Hi, this is Andy Doctor. Well, for those of who have a certain model of Samsung refrigerator, we know that it may have a problem. After a while, it will ice up everywhere, and then it will have a huge, huge noise like the jet engine and stop working entirely. And you probably have to cut the electricity and let the ice fall, and then it will work again. It's super annoying. A lot of people complain about it. And there are actually quite a lot of videos on YouTube talking about how to fix this problem. But let me tell you this, most of those fixes are temporary, including one of my videos. But about almost exactly one year ago, I published a video called a permanent fix. Today though, I am going to give you an update of that. How good was that? Well, the answer is, it totally worked. At least for a year now. I never have any noise. No eyes, you see, those openings are totally clear. Before this fix, every few months, those openings will ice up, unfortunately. Okay, so, of course, I'm not going to repeat the process. It's a little bit more involved. However, if you know how to change oil, you should be able to do that. And I will give the link to that video in the description. Also, at the end of this video for you, so you go check it out, please. Basically, what you need to do is you take out a styrofoam insulator from behind that panel. You may ask why was that? And by the way, what's the purpose of having this insulation anyway? Well, this insulation basically separates the cooling compartment from the heating unit behind for defrost. So yes, Without this insulation, they can exchange heat, and that will reduce the efficiency of this refrigerator. But let's be honest, if the refrigerator doesn't even work, or at least it doesn't work every few months, there's no point talking about efficiency. Okay? Of course, you may ask, but what's the reason? Why removing this one would help though? Here is the issue. The cold air coming out from those opening, and behind it, it basically is the passage. The passage was too small with the insulation, and that is a design defect. Because the passage was too small, you know, the cold air will have a hard time coming out, and because of that, they basically form ice inside, and then, Eyes will be everywhere, including on the circulation fan. And then, of course, the fan blade will hit the eyes, and that creates the crazy noise, sounds like a jet engine. Okay, Removing this one, though, will basically increase the passage of the cold air, and that's why you don't have eyes anymore. So that would be a fix. Okay, fine, let's not call it a permanent fix, because we do not know anything is permanent. Let's call it ultimate fix. This is the fix for your problem. Again, it's a little bit more involved, but if you know how to change oil, you should be able to do that. Now, for Samsung though, please, next time when you design refrigerator, make the passage bigger. Big enough that even with the insulation, it is big enough. So no ice will be formed and we can talk about efficiency and also a working refrigerator all the time. Not one that will start working every few months. And if that fix the problem, Samsung, please contact me and maybe give me some money. But for those that are stuck with this refrigerator, I'm saying that this is probably your best bet. Okay? And if you think this video is helpful for you, please make sure you like and even better, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done that. Look, I am working really hard to increase my subscription base, so your assistance is highly appreciated. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.